Hey guys, it's Josh Pask here, and I'm gonna be bringing you the number one reason why your moving company is probably not growing, and it is something that I see that is so common in the industry, which is ridiculous to me, but hey-ho, it's just part of the industry that we're in. I think it's because, obviously, the industry is quite old in general, and the type of people who are on it don't particularly know maybe how to do this thing that I'm gonna share in this video, and that is the reason why your company's not growing, and it is due to the fact that you do not market your service, marketing. This is the number one reason why your company's not growing, and we're gonna fix that in this video. <sighs> right, marketing is just making yourself known. Marketing is just making yourself discoverable to the marketplace. Now, you might be asking, who is the marketplace? Well, the marketplace is the people that need your service people moving home, people who need a packing service, people who need storage, they need to know that you are in business. And the only way you're gonna do that is by revealing yourself to them, okay? And you reveal yourself to them by marketing your service. Now, there's many ways you can market your service, but there's one particular way, which is, in my opinion, the most important way and the best way and the place where all your clients are every single day, 24 hours a day, which is, you guessed it, it's social media. This is where everyone is nine, 10, 12 hours a day on their phones, on social media, scrolling up and down. Now, the good thing about these social media platforms like TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, even Google, is that they're pretty much all search engines as well. So when someone types in maybe moving company in local area, moving company in said area, the other platforms are gonna pick up that you've searched that on one of these other platforms because of cookies. So cookies is something that tracks basically what you search. And if you didn't know already, TikTok and YouTube are two of the three most, um, well, two of the three biggest social media, um, rather search engines. So Google be number one, YouTube be number two, TikTok be number three. So you've got to realize that half of these social media platforms, they're search engines, right? People are searching in them to find the product or services they want. Now, if someone's moving home, they're gonna type in moving company in said area. If you're not showing up, you're doing yourself a massive disservice. So you need to start showing up, marketing yourself on these social media platforms. So how do we go about doing that? You know, I think this is the real problem is that most companies know they need to start marketing their service on social media. They just don't know how to do it. Unfortunately, to their peril. But just by taking a few hours just to learn these platforms, learn what attracts people's attention is going to set you apart from 99.9% .9 of the moving industry and all the composition in your local area. Okay, so remember, the platforms are TikTok. You might be thinking, isn't it just a bunch of people dancing on TikTok? No, it's not actually. It's actually a great way to get your younger audience, which are maybe your first time buyers, they're on TikTok, okay? So you got Facebook, which is my favorite, because most of your families are on Facebook. They're in Facebook groups, which is completely free, and you can join, there's loads of them in your local area, and loads of your target market, the families with the two three bedroom households who need a packing service, they're on Facebook, okay? You have Instagram. Now, Instagram is like your business card. Business cards, in my opinion, waste of time. I mean, you can keep them in the van and if people are walking past and they, they want you know, a business card, you can give them a business card. But other than that, there's really no point having them. You know why? Because Instagram is your business card. So your vans, if, they're, if they have signage, likely have an Instagram logo on there and they can see the name of your company, very easily someone can literally go on Instagram and type in the name of your company and they can find your business card. So Instagram's like a business card. Okay, and you've got the last one, which is YouTube, which is very underrated. But YouTube is a fantastic way of really showing off your expertise in long form content, right? And really showing off the process of you moving someone's house, right? So YouTube is very underrated and YouTube is the second biggest search ending, um, second to Google. So it's a great place and it's a, lot, it's, a lot, it's a big place where a lot of people are searching for 
you know, a product or service that they need. So all these platforms are where you need to be advertising your service. Now, obviously platforms will come out of fashion and new ones will arise, but it's the same thing. You wanna be posting regularly on all these platforms, hitting your target market. So the first time buyers, the families, business card, and people who really wanna dive deep into your service, they're gonna be on YouTube, so the long form. You wanna be hitting these platforms on a regular basis, bombarding them. How much should I be posting? As much as you possibly can, two, three, four times a day. It's something that it's worth, you know, spending time researching and, you know, maybe even getting some help if you're one of the older heads that really don't understand these platforms and don't know how to use the technology. But you can simply whip out your phone, which everyone has, and you're probably watching this video on right now, right? And there's the camera, pressing the record button, right? And showing what you do. So if you're simply wrapping a chest of drawers, have a bit of charisma about you, throw the blanket of the chest of drawers and explain what you're doing. Hi guys, it's Josh here from Pass Removals. Today I'm gonna to take you through how we look after our client's furniture. As you can see, we have a chest of drawers here. What we're gonna do is simply put one of our blankets over it. This, are, this is a great piece of equipment, um, very easy to use, we just throw it over. Then we use pallet wrap, pallet wrap round the chest of drawers. As you can see, it's nice and protected, ready to be loaded into our van. And that's how we look after our, our client's chest of drawers. Very simple, anyone can do that. It doesn't have to be very eloquent. It doesn't have to be the most charismatic and entertaining thing in the world, but it's definitely gonna set you apart because someone might stumble across that video or someone who's on the edge, don't know whether to choose your company or someone else's company, and they see that video and they see what you do, it shows you, it shows them rather a bit of the expertise that you have and they're gonna choose your company just because you posted something very simple like wrapping a chest of drawers or a piece of furniture. All right, so you wanna be posting on all these platforms as much as you possibly can because there's, they're free, for gonna say. You, you can post on these platforms for free. You're gonna hit your target market. You wanna be obviously using keywords like removals, house moving, in said area. And um, yeah, just advertising your service on social media where all your target market and your target audience and all the people that are moving home are on for hours every single day. Start marketing your service, using social media to do it, and you're gonna see a massive ROI. You're gonna see a massive influx of inquiries and influx of people who are moving that inquire because you have marketed yourself on social media and this will set you apart from the competition and there are enough 99% of the moving companies in the world because most people don't do this. And it, to me, it's crazy, but there you go. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope you start marketing on these social media platforms to really build your business. And the main thing really is that there is someone who is moving home and they need your help, right? They genuinely need your help. They need a packing service. They need a moving service, they need storage, and they don't know where to find a quality moving company. Maybe they've moved before and they've had a bad experience. They've been introduced to cowboys and they really need a proper moving service that's gonna look after them, that's professional, that's gonna turn up on time, that's gonna say what they're gonna do and do it. And you're that moving company, but you don't market your service on these platforms and therefore they cannot find you. So you're doing him a disservice. You're also doing this guy who is your employee a disservice because there's no work for him because you don't market your service to him, right? And you're doing yourself a disservice because you have no jobs. You can't look after your family and your kids because you haven't marketed your service because maybe you're too embarrassed or you're, you feel like you're too old to do it. But I tell you this, spending five, six, seven hours understanding the social media platforms, understanding how to use your camera, which you probably already know how to do, right? Will make your business go from here to here. Believe me, because this helped us go from zero to where we are now in just three years, simply by posting organic social media content on these platforms. I hope this has helped and I hope this gives you a bit of inspiration and a bit of knowledge that marketing is the most important part of business and you need to start marketing to your clients.